here at House D, House Denise, Denise, however you want to pronounce it. All right, talk to this guy real quick. Plus two intimidate and search. That's nice. Plus two to search. Uh, Taggart de Denise. He's going to give us, I believe, the Sentinels of Stormreach. The Sentinels of Stormreach. You don't have to talk to him until the end. And you can do them in any order except for the very last one. you got to do the rest before you do the very last one. I'm going to do them in order. So we got the Bargain Bazaar. we got to go through Searing Heights to get there. I do not know this wilderness really at all. I'm just going to run straight through to where the quest is. Stepping in on Elite. Um, this this quest chain can be pretty tough. Uh, these hobgoblins hit very hard, and they crit they crit quite often. So it can be pretty tough. Right, get these breakables. I dropped a bow and arrows right there because there's a couple of those range targets you gotta hit. Right here. So they turn off my blast, equip my dart, throw my dart, re redo my blast, re equip my scepters. Alright, yeah, these guys hit pretty hard. And they have a chunk of hit points. So you gotta be pretty careful in here. Especially when you start getting to the casters. Was a Mithril battle buckler of healing plus three hardy. Well, that's not too shabby. All right, this one's gonna close as well. I can't target them yet. I'm gonna take care of the guy up top first, but he ran off. There's another bow and arrows that drop right there. All right, get my dart, my handy dart. Now, I'm going to be cutting th through this pretty quick. I'm a fan of this quest chain. Uh, I'll explain why I do it later. Didn't try to bolt him, I didn't have it back yet. I don't think about one shot anybody of the bullets in these quests. There's so many hit points. Grab this lever. We're immediately going to go over there. So I might have a jump. Yeah, jump on this roof, pop up here. There's a caster. Fortunately, my duck didn't get him. That's okay. Oh, I know why they're hitting so much harder now, because they're getting power. Duh. I'll throw a web down right here. Get these guys out of toast. Alright, he's gonna run around to the left. I need to equip that rock in my trinket slot anymore. Yeah, they both missed because they're in the How much does burning blood cost? Ten spell points. Alright, there's a trap here. Let's clear these two guys. Alright, so there's a target thing up top. You don't hit that. You hit that lever right over there. I'm going to try to find this trap. I should be able to. Right. Plus 42 disable now. So I'm keeping it maxed out. I didn't put it any more into this magic device. So I put more into open block this time. But keeping spellcraft, search and disable device maxed out. This control panels for a trap that 
there's two targets up there. If you hit the wrong one, it sets off these uh, whirling spikes. And move around. They might move around. I don't recall. They fill up this area. But the correct one is the left one. As you can see. Alright, come up here because we're almost at the end. I don't do any of the extra stuff here. I just get through these quests. Yeah, he just hit me pretty hard. Really a crit. Alright, I'm a burning blood here. Let's see how that works. Uh, the fire is actually pretty close on that. I didn't see too well there. I'm gonna clear the rest of this trash out. So that's a call to Mad Max Beyond the Thunderdome. Where you have that? He's a pretty blood in me. Where you have Master Blaster. You have the manager. I forget what the guitar's name was. Complete some quest. Forgot to put my voice on. Uh, that lever. I don't know if there's trap box or the other lever. That lever opens to get your chest. might do these in epics. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what uh, what all I'll need. But that was part one of Sentinels of Stormreach. I'm going to go ahead and run through part two, I think. Part two, I think it's the Black Lock. So I'll quickly turn this in. And go run to the... Ugh, stuck on a loading screen. <laughs> 